Welcome to Inside Cart. In this week's Behind the Scene, we follow Quest Drive Mark Blell on a his his own. A day at the office for PacWest driver Mark Blonell consists of negotiating his number 18 Motorola car at speeds of up to 240 miles an hour, navigating his way through the highly competitive cart field. On a recent day off, Mark paid a visit to Parker Elementary School and found himself navigating his way through a series of tough questions. How fast does it go? Guess. 100, 150, 2,000. 2 million! No, no. 250 million! 200! 300! 200 million! Million. Close. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. 500. Uh, you know, we can talk about a lot of subjects as well, and teamwork, and communication, and safety, and careers, and stuff like that. You know, all these guys around, they've got a lot of stuff to do in the future, so, uh, you know, we're going to give them some things to think about. You know, everywhere we go with his children around, there's always a huge interest, and uh, not just from the boys, from the girls as well. It's, it's quite good fun to see their faces, but, you know, all over the States, we've uh, seen lots of interest, and actually for the sport, it's growing, it's getting bigger and bigger, and... You know, these guys are only young, but they'll soon be following it on TV and maybe going to the races with their parents. So it's just an enjoyable day for everyone. I think you know, if they want to look at it for career, there's lots of different avenues that they, uh, they can see. I mean, if the girls want to look at the PR side of stuff or, you know, the marketing stuff and the guys want to look at the mechanical side of things or vice versa, maybe the girls want to look at that side of stuff, you know. And um, some of them might want to be a driver, some of them may be drivers in the future. I mean, who's to say? After the impromptu Q&A outside, Mark gave his presentation and took more questions from the students inside. Well, just today, really, to come and show you a race car, come and introduce us, um, you know, us as a team, Pack West, and our sponsors. Yeah, I know you guys have been learning about um, or what you term as your uh, cooperative team effort, and uh, pretty much we have the same deal. We have the same with our team. It's, it's a team of people. We have about uh, 60 or so people now. Yeah, 70 people back in, uh, in Indianapolis and in Indiana, and that's where our team's based. So if you can imagine, all those uh, 70 people have to work together. There's a lot of team effort, a lot of communication, but they're all aiming for one goal. They're aiming to get our race cars on the racetrack and us to win. Have you ever gotten scared during a race? Have I ever been scared? Uh, yeah, lots of times. I mean, it's when, when you're on the racetrack and the car doesn't handle very well, and you're doing uh, like 200 miles an hour and something just goes wrong, that's when I get scared. How old were you when you started racing? I was 17. 17 years old when I started to race. So I've been racing, uh, I'm now, how old am I now? 32, that's it, yeah, you've got a good memory. Yeah, I'm, so I've been racing quite a while. You know, racing at very high speeds, so we're racing at 200 miles an hour plus. Uh, and, and I just, I love it, I enjoy it, but you know, what I enjoy most is, is winning. Uh, but that's not always possible, sometimes it's pretty hard and sometimes you still have some of your best races and you don't win. You can still come 5th or 6th or 10th and still have a great race. And the children showed their appreciation by sending Mark thank you cards, drugs and good luck charms. And Mark found by giving of himself, he was the one received.